up guys, this is Miss Pre Mermaid and welcome back to another Let's Build. This is episode three. This is number three. Let's build number three, I do believe. So today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to build working Hunger Game pods. And these are the ones that rise up. So um, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to build these, which are really cool. And it looks like a chicken wants to be the host. So, oh my gosh, there it goes. And it's going to come right out there. <laughs> right. So, did it actually go out? I don't actually know. Wait. It's gone. Oh, yeah. I ran away. Wait. Is that... That was a chicken that was right there. Well, it's a sneaky chi chicken. Yeah, I'm just kind of waiting for the night to go by. Um, but while we're at it, I'm going to teach... I'm going to show you guys the blocks you're going to need. And you're going to need uh, all these blocks. So, you're going to need a sticky piston, of course, because that's going to make it rise up and go back down. A uh, redstone repeater. A lever. Redstone, of course. Glowstone. Or you can have uh, three... Uh, two blocks of your choice and you could have a court a, a slab of your choice So you could choose like wood slabs or something like that and any block other you want So yeah, I'm just gonna take a quick nap so we could actually see things and it's not letting me go to bed It's already nighttime. Look at the look at the sky. Look at the sky. Come on. Come on. Come on I Gotta get to bed. Gotta get to bed. Have a busy busy morning busy busy bee. We're gonna have a busy morning. There we go off to bed <laughs> Yeah, I like to do that when I'm in bed because it's so funny. All right Right, so, um, yeah, we're, let's, get, let's, let's get started then. I'm going to take all my blocks, and uh, we're going to get started. I built another platform right here. So, yeah, we're going to start. So, the first thing you're going to need to do is uh, find the hole where you want the people to be in, basically. So, you got to make some holes, and I'm just going to line these up real fast. There we go. So, um, you got to do that, and you can make them equal, and then they'll have, like, let's say... Um, for example, this is going to be the cornucopia, which is basically where all the chests are that you guys put around. You guys will put chests, like, all around here, and then people, they'll, they'll go and grab chests and stuff. And, yeah, that's the cornucopia. So, you want to make them further away, though, so, and um, don't use this, for example. <laughs> don't use this cornucopia, for example, but that's just, let's just say this is, like, a pathway. Follow the emerald brick road. Let's just say follow the emerald brick road, right? Okay, anyways. Um... So yeah, I'm going to be doing this. So the first thing you want to do is you need to dig a, let's see, let's count this, ready? Let's, let's put these up so you can count. You're going to have to dig, after you dig the first hole, you need to dig two more blocks down. So it has to be a three deep hole. And uh, just let me get rid of these. So it has to be a three deep hole. And then you're going to want to, at the bottom, uh, put a sticky piston just right there. And then you're going to want to put a block of your choice, which is the what the people are going to stand on. So, um, I would use a piece of glowstone because it lights it up very, very nicely. Um, so that's the basic thing right there. We'll get to the hard part in a second. So then you have to do, um, if you want something, so let's just do this. Um, yeah, you do all the way up from the bottom of the piston all the way up. You could do it if you like that if you want. And then, ooh, whoa, okay, yeah, so you go all the way up just like that. And you're going to put um, some quartz slabs on top of those blocks that are sticking out of the ground. And basically, it looks really, really cool. I think the quartz and the emerald look really nice together. And we're going to make this one the host pod right now. So we're just going to copy exactly what we did. So sticky piston, glowstone, um, emerald blo blocks around it. So it looks nice. <laughs> and um, then you got to do... Oh, goodness. I was totally placing this in the wrong spot. Don't follow that. Okay, wait. And you got to do quartz slabs around that. So, that's perfect. Okay, now to the hard part. Which is where we're going to do the redstone. So, oop. I didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. Okay. So, oh gosh, I'm so bad. Okay. So bad at building. Uh, you can either do um, one where you stick it like that. But we're going to do the other one. Uh, to where it sticks up. Let's see if I can show you real fast. Like that. And there's a chicken on, on it. So, um, yeah. You need to place a block there, a block there, so you could put a lever on it. And you probably want to cover this up, by the way. I just make it look nice. Actually, I don't even think you can, but uh, you don't really have to anyways. It doesn't really matter if you want to or not, you can. So, uh, after that, what, what did I do? Oh, I know what I did. Okay. Tuck away. Alright, so you could either, you could place it like that, and then you can do this and if we just place these on the side and then this is going to run along so we're going to go down back here and uh, after you place that lever you want to do straight across 
to the other one and we're probably going to want to turn that there. So that just works just like that. And um, after the lever, you want to place redstone going all the way. Oh, goodness. Yeah, going all the way across this just like that. And uh, I think what we actually should do is we should actually make this. Okay, so excuse me, cow. Um, you want to place a redstone repeater heading towards the the uh, piston so it looks like that and you don't have to delay it and then you just go like that connect that so basically you want to do that that's going to turn on and so you want to do the same uh redstone repeater there and you do redstone across this way so that will turn both of these on just like that and you just flip the switch so let me show you quickly how this works you just flip the lever once you're standing in here and both pods will rise up at the same exact time or a little bit. A few times it's like a second off, like a half a second off. Uh, that happens with the Xbox lag. So, um, yeah, basically this is how you make uh, working Hunger Game pods. And if you guys have any more questions about how to do this, uh, if I didn't explain it thoroughly enough, you guys can go ahead and tell me what's wrong or what issues you're having. And I will certainly help you through the comments. So yeah, anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this. And I'll see you guys all next Friday with another Let's Build. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a Let's Play.